everybody. I'm Joe Watterson with The Wrap, and I am here today with the very funny, the very talented, and the star of the upcoming CBS series, Superior Donuts, Mr. Jermaine Fowler. How you doing? Jermaine, thanks for joining us today. Oh, anytime, man. Thanks for having me. Nice, nice to see you. You're about to star on Superior Donuts, but you're primarily known for your work in stand-up. Right. right. And I'm just wondering, so when did you first know you wanted to be a comedian? I would say 12th grade. I was about 17 years old, and uh, uh, my neighbor let me borrow Eddie Murphy Raw. Yeah, it was on VHS, and uh, I watched it every day. And uh, finally, I just said, you know what? I just, I just, I'm gonna do it. I just want to do it. So uh, I did a uh, open mic. Uh, well, it was more of like a talent show back in uh, back in school, I, and I got kicked off stage by the judges because they didn't like my material. And uh, I didn't finish my set, but my friends told me it was the funniest thing they've ever seen. Like someone get kicked off stage. Uh, I didn't even finish my jokes. It was terrible. And uh, had they not told me, like, you know, that was the funniest thing we've ever seen, dog. You should do that again. I probably would not, you know, wouldn't, wouldn't, wouldn't have pursued it. And so if you could please tell us a little bit, what is Superior Donuts all about? Uh, Superior Donuts. It's about uh, a donut shop owner by the name of uh, Arthur Shubashevsky. <laughs> and uh, he's had this donut shop for years, about 46 years. And uh, it's been around forever, north side of Chicago. The problem is that the, the, the neighborhood's gentrifying. It's changing. All the uh, old shops and, uh, you know, that, uh, that, that have been there for years are turning into these corporations, uh, you know, Best Buys and Starbucks. And uh, Arthur's shop might be next if he doesn't do anything about it. So he hires this young, uh, his kid uh, from Northside, uh, the same neighborhood. He's seen the same things happen. He doesn't want it to happen. Uh, and he hires, uh, his name's Franco. I play Franco. And uh, they both uh, just kind of come together. At, uh, well, really, it's not, Arthur doesn't, he's stubborn. So, like, uh, Franco has these ideas to, you know, bring more business into the shop. And uh, Arthur is more hesitant about uh, these new ideas, because he's, he's stuck in his old ways. You're talking about, you know, some really serious issues, but in a very, very funny way. You're talking about race, right. you're talking about class, you're talking about, you know, gentrification, like you were saying earlier. So, I mean, like, when you're writing the show, like, how do you, like, or, like, how do you approach that in a way, like, to make that funny, even though these are really serious issues? These issues are a part of life, you know? Our life, we, we're living, you know, these issues. And uh, our job as comics is to make people laugh at them. You know, uh, unfortunately, you know, racism and uh, police brutality and, uh, uh, you know, uh, all, these, all these crazy things are happening in the world right now that when you have a show like ours, Superior Donuts, it's set in the gentrified area where a young black kid from Northside Chicago and uh, this old white guy is running the shop. You kind of got to bring these issues up. Otherwise, it'd be kind of weird if you didn't. All right, well, thank you, Jermaine. And thank if you, you want to check out Superior Donuts, you can catch a special preview on February 2nd at 8.30, and then it moves to its regular time slot uh, Mondays at 9, starting February 6th.